Hi, this is Greg Mock here from Simply Live, and uh, here I'm going to demo the last application of our Varsity Bundle, which is the RefBox. So here we have our third application. We've gone over the all-in-one, uh, we've covered the replay, and now here we're looking at the RefBox. So this UI is specifically designed towards official referee review or coaching review. So here we're taking the full sources of your mini, whether it's eight or four feeds, and presenting them in the UI to be able to do review. So here, again, we're syncing all these individual ISO sources, but now we've designed the UI specifically more to analysis. So here, if we go to the UI, this we're, we're working with the RefBox 8. Uh, we, we, we're showing the eight boxes here. Unfortunately, for the sake of this demo, I don't have the additional two sources, but if we had the full eight sources, you would be able to see the full eight sources uh, in your UI here. So you see my individual sources and I have my big blue box here which I can use for control so if something happens this, the concept is the same I've got all of my sources they're all in sync and I can go back and review them individually so you know if I want to look here maybe where the foot was for the shot I can look in any of these views for example you know I can pinch and zoom inside of any of these you know, and look, and I can decide, okay, from this full view, maybe, okay, I see that these four are good. I can select those, double tap. Now you see I've switched to a four look view. Same idea, you know, I can control them here and look at them. I can go frame by frame or roll them at a, at a specific speed and back up and again within any of these sources I'm able to pinch and zoom maybe I decide I want to look at these two so I can go from the full eight to the four to two again within any of these pinching zooming looking controlling and now maybe I decide okay I want to look at this full screen and I can go up to full screen and have full control and flexibility again designed to be very simple very intuitive for analysis you know and again stepping frame by frame if I want to reset my zoom I can or if I want to step back through my previous views and bring me back to the beginning and again I can clear my selections and decide you know I want to look at this one full and go to a very quickly again pinch zoom roll very simple So if anything happens and I want to keep it, if an action takes place, I can simply you know, select cues or I can make clips. So if an incident happened and I want to be able to catalog it, I can go to clips and mark it in, go to the end of when an action might be or use my little jaw control here, mark it out and I can save it. So now you see I've saved my clips that I can come back to later or if I have an incident that only took place on certain particular angles, I can select those and again, mark my specific clips on the angles that I have selected and save them and that will, you see here for example, I have four and five. So it's showing me that I've clipped those individual clips in particular. So of course at any other point you wanna review something, I can select it and it will bring me back to that time code or I can set up an export I have export so here in the management of my system I can have in the back end either network attached, uh, attached storage or USB attached storage and simply select all of this content export it and then have access to it either later on offline for the officials to review did they miss a call did they make the right uh, calls for analysis or even for coaches for coaches to be able to do um, you know analysis uh, for players and, and things like that um, so here again in the varsity bundle this is a single user but not to get into too much but in 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 the in the system we can actually go if you go to our larger system you could have multiple users so if you have a larger setup uh, and you need multiple users you know somebody's maybe gonna pre-select from eight you know, I, I'm an operator that's selecting from eight, maybe I need to narrow it down to four, I can do that, and then I can have different user roles, so I can add different user roles here, 
uh, to be a master and a slave, for example, or a master and sink. And simply what that means is, you know, I may pre-select the down and select four angles that then I pass on to another operator who might be the referee and keep it very streamlined and simple for them to be able to do their analysis. So again, simple, single user, or we can scale this to be multiple users in larger setups, larger workflows to be able to do, for example, a centralized. I've got multiple games going on coming back to a centralized review uh, setup and be able to be very flexible in, in what we're doing. Also other little features is PIP. So if we talk about basketball and one of my sources is you know, my clock, unfortunately I don't think I have uh, a direct clock feed here, but you can imagine from here I can decide that if I have a view of a clock somewhere, you know, I can go in and I can create a PIP and set it up so that now this could be actually one of my separate sources so when I'm doing my analysis if I have a clock I could actually have that uh, in sync with whatever video I'm looking at to do the analysis uh, from from uh, if it's a shot clock or you know end, end of a quarter end of a half type scenario So uh, again, the, the varsity bundles here, we allow you to have up to eight, or you know, if you have the ref four, it would be, you know, it would be starting out with the four angles. Uh, from this, uh, if, if you scale up, we can certainly go up to even much larger setups, 16, uh, 32 cameras and, and, and multiple layouts. Uh, just to show you here, one last thing, I can actually create and build predetermined layouts. So if I have specific cameras or angles that I need to review, I can, preload certain layouts and be able to jump through those very quickly. And that is uh, the review of the ref box for the varsity bundle.